What up, beautiful people? It is time to start our eBay breaks. 2017-18 Panini Revolution Basketball. Four box half case break number two. Oh, it's dark. The Lord said, let there be light. All right. Yeah, that, that's decent, kind of, sort of. All righty. Um, that's, uh, let's get that out of there. No, that's not it. There we go. All right, cool. It's eBay time. So let's go ahead and have the break up on the screen. Now we're only doing four boxes of this. One, two, three, and four. Let me put the rest of this away. Closet, but whatevs. All righty. All right, here we go. So Jimbo got that lower back pain. Oh, so okay, gotcha. A reoccurring injury or something. Are you, not not for nothing, Jimbo, but are you active? Like, do you, do you exercise or anything like that? Like stretching, you know, anything like that? Because not for nothing, uh, I, I used to, well, I still suffer from, from some lower back pain. But that's because I'm a fat boy. Right? So... There was a time where I was like very active, and dude, I I, I, get, I lost a lot of weight. I was weighing like 230, which was probably the it's it's actually the lightest I've ever been uh, in my adult life. This was like two years ago, and dude, not for nothing, I was I felt no lower back pain at all. I, I would I would suggest Jimbo, you know. Make sure you stretch every day. Make sure you stretch for sure, and do like light cardio, man. Like you, like get you know, ride a bike, or or maybe go for a jog. You know, jog like I used to jog back when I was at my fittest. I, I used to jog at least two miles a day in the morning. Then when I went to the gym later on, I I, I would do two a days. I, I'm trying to get back to that. Um, I would jog two miles in the morning. First thing I do when I wake up, jog two miles. Boom, go on with my day. Then when like I would get out of work, I would go to the gym, and then I would jog. I would get on the treadmill and do like four miles. Um, and, and just do that. That definitely helped out. So if you have blown knees, I was going to say riding a bike would definitely be a good option for you. Or swimming, bro. Like, dude. You have you you will discover muscles and body parts that you didn't know existed once you start swimming, dude. Swimming is great for all that, bro. So you know, give it give it a try, man. Give it a try. I'm definitely trying to get back into that fit lifestyle. You just you feel more energetic. You just you just feel better, man. Uh, now the Wizards might feel a little bit better with this auto ported Junior. Sunburst numbered to 75. That's nice. Jimbo, stupid question. Does it snow in Australia? Because here in, uh, in, in, in South Florida, we're going to be getting a cold front this weekend. It's, a, it's that time of year. It's going to be like in the 50s, 60s on Saturday morning. Heck yeah. 
I like the cold. I love the cold. to us Floridians that is cold that is I'm gonna put my beanie on my hoodie my sweatpants my Ugg boots my 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 mittens and my scarf that is when Floridians bust out their 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 one cold, cold outfit <coughs> that they wear once a year Dude, that is cold bro when you when you consider that our normal weather is above 90 degrees year round with a hundred percent humidity when it gets like dude that 40 degree change is massive especially when you're used to the sun the entire year i mean it's, it's different it's different all right what do we have here a showstopper Lonzo Ball for the Lakers. That's cool. That would have been even nicer if it was like a variation. But it's just a base one. We have Jordan Bell, rookie for the Warriors. He's going to be getting uh, more minutes this year, especially with... Uh, JaVale McGee gone and Boogie Cousins still injured. He'll be getting lots of minutes. And not for nothing, he was solid as a rookie. Very solid. Let's see if he can improve on that and, you know, get better this year. Oh, that is ridiculous, Jimbo. That is nothing. Oh, my God. Well, Chris Fitz, what can I say? You know, it's it's what we do. It is what we do. Yeah, well, that's what I was going to say. Uh, kids play for life. It's preseason. <laughs> Draymond Green didn't play... But I will say, it, it definitely looked, definitely was impressive. All right, this is the third box. We got a sunburst for the Cavaliers, Derek Rose. That is to uh, 75. I'm just, I'm a little sad, Chris Fitz, that I won't see it break. Because after today, your boy is on a little mini vacay. I will not be live Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. I'll be back at it on Monday, though. Gordon Hayward of the Celtics. Autograph right there. That's nice. I think so, Chris Fitz. I definitely think so. He freaking better. You tell him I said that, Chris Fitz. Russell Westbrook lift off uh, impact. Right there. He freaking better. There we go here. Exactly. There you go, Chris Fitz. <clears throat> Box Mojo. What do we got, yo? Yeah, Chris Fitz. Uh, he's he's in charge of uh, 
tracking down anything that's missing or you know buying replacements and things of that nature I'm just a pretty face to look at you know all right let's see what's in this last box here two autographs and four boxes is very good uh, when it comes to revolution very hard to get autographs it's mostly about the variations and whatnot uh, Dirk Nowitzki here to 75 for the Mavericks when is this dude gonna retire man straight up he needs to retire this year but he's probably not going to we have Russell Westbrook of the Thunder liftoff die cut is Russ gonna average another triple double who knows we'll find out though another auto ding three autos in four boxes I gotta tell you people that is very difficult to do in Revolution Basketball. I might play the lottery tonight. And an OB Raptors rookie auto there. Uh, I hope that he has a really good uh, second year. Especially with DeMar DeRozan gone. Him and Kawhi Leonard, low key, they could make some moves out there in Toronto. Toronto might be really good this year. Honestly, I think they're going to be better this year than they were with DeMar DeRozan. For those of you guys that are, are uh, consistent viewers of mine, know that I am not a fan of uh, DeMar DeRozan. I call him the worst superstar in the NBA. He's a superstar, but he is the worst. All right, recap. We got a Dirk to 75, Derrick Rose 75, Otto Porter Jr. to 75. Y'all remember when Derrick Rose won the MVP, the youngest MVP ever? When he used to dominate. Good times. And an OB, Raptors rookie auto, Gordon Hayward of the Celtics, and Jordan Bell rookie auto for the Warriors. And that's going to do it for the break. Thank you, eBay, and we'll get it out to you.